these tubes back at the river. We'll do a little bit. Just want to show y'all a little bit where we're at. Out here on the porch. We uh, almost got it all done. Still have to come around and do the rail. But we'll get to that. Got the platform for the stairs right here. Probably come down. Have a staircase right here. So you have access to the porch. I did get the, uh, the gable trimmed out, insulated. Um, missed that video, can't find it, sorry. But me and Tam uh, blew in the insulation and we capped it, stuck to trim it out and uh, make it look real, real good. But then we stained the siding, boxed out the window here with cedar and the same over here with these two, box those windows out. If you look back on some of my old videos, uh, you'll see that when I did frame it, it was, it's almost like a bird's box, not quite, but, uh, but anyway, so I had to rip some cedar down, make it look halfway decent, but I think they turned out okay. So I'm gonna do cedar all the way around the outsides on all the trim. So we'll uh, get to that. Maybe when the weather gets a little cooler, just trim all this out. And then uh, I think what I'm gonna start doing here, is I'm gonna start putting uh, the trim around the tops here and start trimming out inside. So um, having a hard time finding trim, but I was able to find some today. So that's a good thing. But uh, you can kind of see in here kind of what the finished product will look like when we get the rest of it done so we have moved some stuff in up here so we sold our house my brother dan his wife kathy sold theirs so we do have some couches our old table and uh there's a bed and in each room so we're uh we're doing the showers are done um we'll need to get a light to show y'all because they they turned out really good they turned out really nice really nice So those are done. Need to finish the trim just a little bit in this area. But we've got uh, that. All the flooring is in. I know I've got one little video of that. But uh, flooring went really nice, really easy. Time consuming, but easy. We got that. We got the uh, upper cabinets home in the kitchen. Got the kitchen sink in. The stove will go right there. But haven't got it yet. So anyway, need to finish trimming out over there. Need to finish trimming downstairs. We've got. And down here, got a couple beds in the bunker rooms. A little, little premature on the furniture move in, but you gotta do what you gotta do, I guess. So, I'm gonna show y'all. We did, um, we got with the power company, so we are no longer on a temporary pole. 
So our temporary pole was here. And then uh, right up here, up the hill right there, you can see we, we did a power station. So they dropped the power from the pole, put it right there. We had to put a 200 amp breaker in there and they hooked up and then we just trenched. Came down here to the back of this South Connex and put it there. So it's all in. I'm not sure I went over the mousetrap game with y'all, but that's all the plumbing for the showers. Got the toilets and the showers, and it all runs down one. So, got that going. And the process room, I apologize, it's pretty messy, but I'll show y'all what we got going on there. And then uh, we're gonna get to work and uh, let me give y'all some updates. But process room, it's a little messy. It's gonna be process slash utility. Um, sorry, it's messy, but we got the our pressure tank in here, right? And then we do have our hot water, and then the electricity is still uh, in the works there. So and be careful because it's hot. So you don't want to touch any true wires. And then uh, we've got the, the one four-way plug there. It's, it's the one electricity we have right now. So we're kind of using it as we go. But anyway, hope you all are enjoying it. And uh, we're going to get busy. And I will uh, keep you all informed. See you. I think I'm gonna start out here in the entry, frame all this, and we'll trim all this out. I think uh, it's been a slow go, the lumber and everything this morning, so um, just try to knock off something pretty simple, you know, see how far I can get on the trim in here. So, on the bottom, so we'll see. I'll be get that, maybe that'll be a good day. Gotta figure out how to close that in. I'm gonna put that floor up there on top of the 20 foot container. But we'll trim it out. It'll look good one way or the other. Alright. That's the plan. We're gonna put stuff together and um, we'll start getting after it. Well, rock and roll is pretty good. Got a little bit going on. Just made my first screw up of the day though. And that door, I cut that piece, top piece too long, so I have to pull it off and redo it. But hey, that happens. But we're rolling, we're getting there. We're getting there. That little feather is two by two. Pretty cheap. Pretty inexpensive, I think it looks really good for, for what we're doing here. You know, it's rustic and dusty a little bit. So. Alright, I'll be back at it.
care of that little mistake. It turned out pretty good. So, moving right along. So we pretty much got the hallway trimmed out. I think it's turned out pretty good. So, I'm doing this level. Kind of see, got it all boxed in. Put all the food. Around the base of the stairs. I'll have to trim up the stairs as well. Probably gonna be a later day. Over here, trimming out the doorway. This is just a case to open, so I'm just trimming it out, trimming it out just for a case to open. So I think it's looking pretty good though. All right, we'll be, get back after it. Well, well, moving some stuff out of the way to do some flooring. Look what I found. Hmm. Looks like we've had a uh, visitor not too long ago. I'm going to have to keep my eye out for him or her. Trim's coming along pretty good. I'm over here in the bunk room now. So, I think I'm gonna call it a day. Come back and get at it tomorrow. Case opening turned out pretty good. So, anyway, I'm gonna do that. And, uh, I'm gonna continue on. All right, continue the rock and roll.